Hey guys, Brady here, and uh, wow, has it been a long time since I've last made a video. Um, so I'm going to be talking about, um, I'm gonna, I have another video coming out after this, but first let's talk about the new Planet of the Apes movie um, called Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes, which actually is a kick-ass title for the new movie. I'm really excited to see what they do with this movie. It's actually, I want to see what, what the kingdom is of these apes. So that's kind of, I don't know, really cool title. I'm really excited for this. Although it's going to be under Disney and they're, I'm afraid that Disney may try to Disneyfy it and wokeify it by adding identity politics into the movie when it doesn't need to be because the first three movies of this trilogy uh I think War for the Planet of the Apes is like the weakest one in my opinion but it's still really good I like the first two movies a lot um War for the Planet of the Apes is good but it's just not as great as like Dawn or Rise um it's the weakest one if I had to uh, choose what the weakest one of the trilogy is so far it'd be War um I mean, there there were some really good moments in the movie, but I don't know. I I I'd, I'd watch like Dawn or or like or uh, Rise over that, or like any of the uh, originals, like the original Planet of the Apes, or maybe Escape. Actually, I have to, I have to see Escape again. Anyway, um, that's besides the point. Um, like I said, so we get to the trilogy, but still really good. Not it's by far not a terrible movie. Um, really good probably the best looking one too as far as cinematography goes um but anyway so another issue i may have with this is the director they chose is wes ball who is known for the maze runner trilogies which i'm not a huge fan of like ya dystopian movies um they're not as good as like other movies that that um within that genre well, not the genre of what uh, dystopian young uh, young adult dystopian stuff but it's just like for example the fifth wave with um chloe moretz i don't like that movie that much i um what's it called it's like a y version of like san andreas or or the day after tomorrow it, it like like i i love disaster movies when i saw the trailer i was like oh this is gonna be good and then i saw then the trailer went on and said, based on the New York Times bestseller, like, oh, it's one of those YA movies, isn't it? And it just kind of loses me because these YA movies, they're not really that great in my opinion. I've, the first Divergent was good enough, but the last two movies sucked. Um, uh, don't even get me started on the Twilight movies. Like the, like the best YA movies are probably Harry Potter and... Yeah maybe hunger games the first two movies were good but uh mocking jay part one and two were lackluster in my opinion so the fact that they got a director who did these ya movies i'm not too thrilled about i wish they would have gotten like rupert wyatt to return or something because i thought rise of the planet apes may maybe be maybe my favorite of the of the trilogy so far um it's a damn shame that rupert wyatt hasn't really done anything great since rise he did the uh, the Gambler with Mark Wahlberg, which was good, um, and then Captive State was really boring. Um, so I don't know, I but I I thought his, his his Apes movie was really good, and I want him to return. Uh, Matt Reeves obviously is is too busy with the Batman movies right now, so I understand why they couldn't get him. But I wish they would have gotten someone a little bit better than Wes Ball. Um, I, I can't think of anyone. Maybe Travis Knight, because I thought Bumblebee was pretty good. Or, um, Ruben Fleischer, um, which he, he's going to be in a, uh, he's going to be the topic of my next video. Um, I know people aren't a, hu a huge Ruben Fleischer fan. I love the Zombieland movies. I really enjoyed Venom and and um, and Uncharted. Um, I know people aren't really a huge fan of those last two movies, but I thought they were fun movies, especially Uncharted. Um, but I, 
I don't know. I I, th- I feel like just the director of Maze Runner just such, is such a step down from from Matt Reeves. So I'm a little skeptical with this new movie, but the title alone sounds fun enough, sounds interesting enough that I hope it's good. This is going to be a bigger movie for him. So we got that. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do you think Wes Ball has what it takes to do like a big budget um, IP like like Planet of the Apes? Or do you not? Um, I don't know. I'll have to wait for a trailer or some, or some sort of footage or promotional anything. Um, but as of right now, I'm skeptical and or skeptical and yeah.